Hey, this is Dr. Jaime, sports chiropractor, also certified athletic trainer. Today what I'll be going over are some core stability exercises while you're in a push-up position or in a plank position. To find core neutral, set yourself up as shown. From there you want to flatten out your back as much as you can, then arch your back as much as you can, then find somewhere in between. From there you want to make sure that you keep your core muscles contracted and hold the position as shown. Finding core neutral in a push-up position is similar. Make sure you set yourself up as shown, and then from there you want to arch your back and flatten your back as much as you can, then find somewhere in between. Hold this position by keeping the core muscles nice and tight. This challenging exercise can first be performed by setting yourself up as shown. Then you want to find core neutral, spread your feet out about hip width apart, and keep your hands a little bit closer than shoulder width apart. From there, alternate your hands from left to right. Make sure as you do this exercise, your core is in neutral. If you start to sway towards one side or the other and break form, stop, reset, then repeat. With this particular exercise, first find core neutral. From there, keep your hands about shoulder width apart. With your abs tight, raise one leg at a time, alternating from left to right. If you start to falter or sway towards one side, stop, reset, then repeat. This exercise combos the last two protocols. First find core neutral, from there you want to raise up one arm and raise the opposite leg, alternating from left to right. This is a very challenging exercise, so if you find yourself breaking form, make sure you stop, reset, then repeat. With this exercise, you're going to be balancing on your elbows and your knees. You want to first find core neutral. From there, you're going to lift your hip off of the platform. From there, your shoulder, hip, knee should be one straight line where your body is not shifted forward or backwards, but you should be erect and straight. To make this exercise more challenging, first find core neutral. From there, set yourself up as shown and rotate your body so that your elbow approximates towards the floor. Here's a change to the same exercise with your elbow straight. Reach over and underneath your body, twisting your torso as shown. Those same exercises that were performed on your knee can also be performed with a staggered stance where one foot is in front of the other as shown. You can find core neutral and hold that static position. You can find core neutral, place your hand on your head with your elbow bent, and rotate your body as shown. Or you can keep that elbow straight out and bring that hand above you and underneath your body while you're rotating. This exercise works out the core muscles and also the gluteals. You want to first find core neutral, then raise your hip up off of the platform. From there, you want to spread your knees apart as shown, making sure that you do both sides. When performing this exercise, make sure that you do not sway forward or backwards, but maintain a nice straight position. <laughs> 